high that I had yeah. I had a lot of uh, questions and comments regarding the uh, projective identification one of them uh, talking about uh, that we have discussed the issue that everybody puts their negative aspects into the outside world and then begin to react to it uh, with regard to the projective identification. Again, with regard to projective identification discussion, it's a very complex issue. And basically with regard to that person who said, uh, I just woke up and I was just l listening to that and got upset. We can just wake up in our uh, dazed uh, condition and uh, deal with some issue related with the projective identification. I'm not a uh, extreme expert in that. I have knowledge about it regarding to the psychoanalytic training that I had. And therefore, uh, we can take every discussion as face value and whatever we hear in the media or any other kind of like discussions with regard to uh, psychiatry <clears throat> and uh, psychiatric uh, disorders as what it is that we hear and then applying that to ourselves and others without uh, understanding and uh, keeping in mind the intricacies of uh, the uh, human beings and their relationship to each other and their uh, uh, complex uh, manner with which each one of us is being raised and the relationship that we have to our uh, background and to our ancestral and cultural and environment therefore one of the issues that I want to discuss right now keeping all that in mind is that the projective identification process usually happens in us as human being basically on the fact that we project, we, we put it out, we uh, put the uh, inner conflicts, problems, good, bad, whatever we have in us and project it into the object world, into the outside, into people around us, into uh, people who we have intimate relationships with. And then we could either praise them, which again is a very complicated issue that the praising in a very close relationship uh, would come across from what as a narcissistic and uh, self-absorbed uh, uh, loved uh, quality that we have in ourselves that we see in others and then we praise them and we're happy about that now at the same time you might just go to work and then you see that someone that you've been working with your co-worker your uh, a uh, boss, uh, your friend, coming in a very bad mood and that day they're not really reacting to you good, uh, in a good manner and then begin to criticize you, begin to be upset at you, begin to put you down and be frustrated. Now, it doesn't mean that what they're doing is only bringing the bad things in them and putting it in us. It could be really that they are seeing those things. They are seeing those problems and flaws in us. And they begin to react to that. However, the interesting part is that this has been in us all the time. But today or that day, because this friend of ours or this person or this wife and this husband and this child of ours who is in conflict and pain and frustration 
project those feelings and then to un understand those uh, uh, feelings in us and then resonate with that and then respond and then begin to criticize us. So it doesn't mean that everybody is going around and putting the bad things in the world as one of the um, interested uh, people who uh, saw uh, the previous comments uh, commented on that. It means that this mechanism is important to understand and if we understand that we are going to be reacting less self-critical and self-depreciating with regard to what we see from outside criticizing us. So therefore, uh, again, this understanding helps decrease the self-critical sense of ours and self-blame and then decrease the blaming that we begin to put all upon ourselves and then because of that we're going to become more strong and successful because blaming ourselves is the main problem that causes to double existing issues. If I have a problem that uh, I'm upset about and then someone brings that out and then I begin to blame myself I'm adding to the problem that I have so I have to deal with two problems now one in myself and one that others brought it up so basically it's a very complicated issue as I said and I hope uh, that uh, uh, we'll discuss that uh, more and uh, I appreciate your comments and your attention thank you